Well, here we are. We're having this is this is what my logo looks like, and the whole it it stands for one drawing every day, no matter what. And the idea is that we're going to go for 180 days live. And I was showing you earlier all of these that we've done so far. And what we're going to do right now, today on day number, day number 114, we're going to draw the diving dolphin. What do you got? Does that sound good? Give me one thumbs up or two thumbs up if that sounds good. All right. So we're right here. We are at West Elementary School here in Michigan, 39 hours, 39 hours after I was in Dubai at the Sharjah Reading Festival, and here I am with you guys. Someone say, awesome. awesome. All right. So, well, it's really up to you guys. Or, I don't know. Should we draw the fat squirrel? Yeah. I don't know. Should we draw the seahorse? Yeah. I don't know. Or, or maybe a big banana. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, maybe, maybe, look at, maybe my sister going, yay! Oh, you know what? This, this owl would be pretty cool. Want to draw that owl? All right. Uh, but you know what? Let's draw, let's draw the dolphin here, right here. Just go. All right. Now, now, you guys, I'm doing two cameras at once. You kids are drawing with me on this camera. And here is, see, I'm covering up the kids so they can't see you. And actually, kids, take your paper. Put your paper over your face so I see your eyes. I can't see it. So I have to, no, turn to your paper. I want to see your drawings. Don't show me the back. Put your drawings over your nose. You got to put your drawing over your nose. So we're disguising your identity. I want to see your eyes. Honey, you're doing it reverse. Put your drawing below your nose. Put your drawing below your nose. Okay, here we go. Look at that. Ooh, there's all good. All right. That's what I want to see. There we go, you silly. Now, take your paper, you genius artist. We're going to draw. There we go. We're going to draw the dolphin. Now, start here. Curve it. The bottom, watch this, the bottom of the, the dolphin's gonna be breaking free. Now I'm trying to remember to leave room down here for the tail. Whenever I draw the dolphin, it always seems like I run out of room for the tail. So I wanna make sure I have room. So the bottom of the dolphin's gonna go way into the next square. And then I'm sketching it lightly. This is the different stage. We start with a light line. We're gonna draw the snout. Now dolphins have longer snouts than porpoises, so we'll draw. A, a, a dolphin. Now the forehead is going to come up and come down. This is a wonderful skewed curve. A skewed curve is a curve that's curving more at one end than the other, and it gets smaller as it comes down. And now let's look at our source. See, this is what this is what the drawing is going to look like when we're done. And we'll draw a picture of you. Who's that going to be holding the fin? Who's that? What's your name? Yeah. Whoever that be, you guys holding on. So let's sketch it. Where's the fin going to be? Now remember, if you're having fun, you can draw over 117 of these that we've already recorded and we reposted to Facebook, reposted to YouTube. And you can also go to, what's this right here? Amazon Prime. I do drawings with me on Amazon Prime. All right, so draw the... Draw the dorsal fin, and we're detail, we're darkening the detail. Let's draw the fin of the dolphin. And back here, put a dot about in the middle. All right, so look at, look at how many territories we covered. We started with our pencil power rocket, and then we, we drew our marshmallow family. We talked about the science of drawing a little bit, and how those 12 Renaissance words over here will help you conquer that flat paper and build up your drawing skill. All right, so the pectoral fin, the side fin's over here, the side fin's down here. That's called, say pectoral. pectoral. Somebody say pectoral. pectoral. Somebody out there in, the, in my uh, Facebook world, type in the text, text the word pectoral. That's a important word 
and the back fin is called dorsal. This fin is a little smaller, look at it. See that, it's a little bit smaller back here. A little bit smaller. All right, kids, I'm looking at you. Give me one thumbs up or two thumbs up out in the audience. How do you keep it up on the dolphin? Is this your favorite drawing so far? Isn't that cool? Is it that? Now, here's that word. Remember, we talked about this word right here, size. Look at that fin. See, it's larger. It's closer. Here, draw the... Hey, gentlemen. Gentlemen, look up here. Look, look, look. I'm going to draw his eye. Be careful. Don't make him look like he's like squashed. Open his eye up there a little bit. He's jumping. Woohoo! I'm gonna draw his belly. I'm gonna give him a little belly right here. See that? Curve his belly. They curve it down here. Now, for the fin, watch, put a dot here. I think, you know what I'll do? I'm gonna, I'm gonna curve the fin from this point right here. I'm gonna curve that fin out. That, he's jumping. He's taking off. And I'm gonna shade down here. I'm gonna put a shadow underneath the fin. And on this one, you're gonna make it blended. Blend underneath the belly, get light as you go across. And you definitely want to shade that back fin. It's darker and it gets lighter as it comes down here. Isn't that cool? Oh, don't forget the little blowhole. Now, who's holding on to the front, to the fin? Man, you guys are swimming fast. Okay, this girl right here. All right, come here, bring me, come up here. I want to see your drawing. And then I need someone else. And uh, you get up here. Yep, come here. Bring me your drawing. And you guys, come here. Can I? All right, come here. Here, stand right here. Give me your drawing. I want to put your drawing. What's your name? Maddie. Look at, look at this. Look at your drawing, you guys. Isn't that awesome? So Maddie's here. We're gonna, oh, we're going to put all you guys hanging on to his fence. So Maddie's going to be on the fence. That's really cool drawing, Maddie. That looks great. Here, let me let me have my have these guys see your drawing. There's Maddie's drawing. That's so wonderful. Go back to your seat, Maddie. Maddie, you're going to be holding. Then he's going to be holding your foot. So this is going to be. Well, that's a nice drawing, dude. This is Day Dayton. Okay, go. Okay, go sit down. Then here's Elisa. These are so good, Elisa. Someone say Elisa. And then here is, and look at her drawing. These are really good. <clears throat> look at her notes. She's such a scientist. All right. So we got to draw uh, Maddie, right? Where's Maddie? All right, here's Maddie first. You guys have to help me remember all the names. Here's Maddie's so fingers. And there she is. Look at it. We're going to draw her face. And she's holding on for dear life. Maybe she's waving her arm up in the sky. Maybe she's up here and she's waving. Yahoo! Here's your nose. Oh, this will be fun. Now on this one, I don't know if she's screaming with joy or screaming for, because she's scared that she's going 100 miles an hour. What do you think? Is she screaming for joy or is she screaming, help me! So here she is, and here's her, her feet. Here's her feet. Oh, this is funny. And what's the dolphin's name? I wonder, is the dolphin? All right. See? And. It's up to you guys. You can use your imagination. I'm gonna put water, shh, concentrate, concentrate, concentrate. Oh, good job, you guys got quiet so fast. I'm gonna put water splashing out from down here. Oh, this is fun, we can take this and I'm gonna have water 
like a big water splash coming out here. Now you teachers, if you remember, I did a lot of uh, ocean images and water and, di and uh, diving in the uh, show, The Imagination Station, that was aired out of Grand Rapids Public Television for years and years and years. Thanks for remembering that. We, now, in the, the back, watch this. What I'm gonna do is back behind here, I'm gonna darken that water behind the splashes to make it more 3D. So the dolphin's really jumping out. Just action lines, that's a powerful word. All right, thank you guys for concentrating. You're doing so good. Oh, that looks great. Now, there's a tool you could use if you want to ask your parents to get you a really cool uh, tool to help you with your lessons. This is called a blending stomp right here. And you can take this and you blend it. It's just a compressed paper. I've had this for months and months and months. And we're going to blend it. And we have, see, now here at the school, you guys, we're going to do one more drawing with you together. But for my friends on Facebook Live, I just wanted to make sure you saw that we did day number 114. We drew a dolphin. And I want to thank, we have over 1,000 people. Actually, we have 11 people on right now. And I want to say hi to them real quick. We have Lisa Weiling in Sao Paulo, Brazil. We have Andrew from Pennsylvania. Karen Wall from, Karen, where are you from? Don, where are you from? We have Russia. Say hi, Russia. Hi. We have We have Israel. Say hi, Israel. Hi, Israel. And we have Germany and England. California. All right. All right, someone say pencil power. Okay, for you guys, for you guys out there, we have Karen Walls in Michigan. All right, guys, thank you all Facebook people. I love you, and we'll draw day 115 tomorrow. Remember, the important thing for everybody is to draw one drawing a day, no matter what. Our goal is 180 days. Everybody say bye, Facebook world. Bye.